All right, good afternoon, everyone. Thank you so much for keeping it here on Fox 26 as we bring you this digital debrief as we continue to follow that explosion at a chemical plant in San Jacinto County. This is all happening at Sound Resource Solutions in Shepherd on FM 1127. It's about an hour and a half north of Houston. All north and southbound traffic on Highway 59 from Goodridge to Shepherd is shut down. Now, 40 people are employed at that chemical plant. 19 of them were at work at the time of the explosion. We're told one employee was injured during a forklift incident and taken to the hospital hospital with first to third degree burns. The president of that business says that the employees, the employee is expected to make it back home here tonight with his family. Now the fire is out. That's what you're looking at right now. Video of firefighters putting out that fire spraying chemical foam to make sure that's all under control. We're waiting for another update from officials here at 4 p.m. in about 20 minutes or so. But right now we want to take a look at traffic and how that may be impacting that surrounding area with Coco Dominguez north, but understand that it will affect some people. This is your typical traffic. What we're looking at right here right now. I do want to focus right here. You see all purple. This means complete closure. There has been complete closure here four hours 59 north at FM 1127. Now that's happening from Shepherd all the way to Livingston. All of this is completely shut down. You will need some alternate routes and some patience to get you through. If you're going in the northbound direction, you're seeing right here. Things are starting to get a little heavier right here by Napier. So the alternate route traveling north will be the 424 loop. They're going to have you exit the freeway and make your way around. Depending on where you're going, you're just going to have to really take your time and go one block along the way and see how far you can get. If you're coming into town in the southbound direction, you have a couple of options on US 190 in either direction. This is right before Livingston is where they're going to shut things down. You can see the purple. I know there is a lot of closure. It's been going on for hours, but understand that US 59 northbound. This area is not typical typically heavy with traffic, so you're not going to experience a lot of traffic until you really get outside of the Cleveland area. And of course, as things progress, we'll give you the latest.